Hey everybody, welcome back to Eternity. Whoa. Hmm. Pushed me off the ledge. How rude. So anyway, this is map 36, uh, Kinosis. It was by Yukiro. And the musician was Dragonfly. And this is a big boy. This is a big boy. We're definitely going to be saving on this one. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, I don't know. This is uh, apparently the Magnum Opus... And, I don't know, after playing Ev Eternity 1, map 32, which uh, Ikero also created, yeah, it's not really all that surprising, is it? I gotta say, a very, uh, kind of going back to the, like, normal, I don't know, down-to-earth sort of thing. We're not really in the whole, like, um, oh, what do you want to call it, the abstract dimension anymore. And boy, what an atmosphere. Uh. Oh. Is that a lift? Oh no. What do I do? <laughs> Is there a, uh... Hmm. I just... Nope. So do I just... Oh, okay, never mind. I see it. <laughs> uh, is there another... Oh, okay. There we go. We just keep... Okay. Alright. That makes sense. A little hard to see, but... It's not too bad. Alright, we're off to a start, that's for sure. So this kind of seems like a a very sunlusty sort of puzzle, actually. Well, with the arch files being oof. Ow. I feel like I'm being told to go fuck myself. <laughs> nope. Yeah, I knew that wasn't gonna happen. Alright, let's try that again. So you definitely need the Berserk to uh, punch the size of the Hell Knight's face for free. There we go. Really? Really? And we just have to be a little more careful with positioning. Definitely have to kill this guy a little faster. Oh, there was health down there too. That's a shame. Come on, can you fall down? Thank you. Alright, down we go. Alright, so, uh, what does that do? <laughs> so the Archies are definitely gone. Or no, they're not gone. The Hell Knight's definitely gone. Alright, so I need to figure out what's going on here. Oh, that'll do it. Let me just kind of sneak down here again in my little hidey hole. Nope. No zappy. Just imp punchy. There we go. Whew. I'm guessing it's probably going to be the way forward. Nope. Those are revenants. Alright. I always love that lovely little arch file moan. It's very, very pleasant, gotta say. Yeah. I figured I'd be a little bit more aggressive than usual with that Revenant. Because he's a jerk. Jeez. Well, he definitely knows how to start a map. <laughs> Alright, there's that pole there. Can I teleport on there? Is there enough room? No, well, we're gonna give it a shot. Well. Okay, there we go. That's more like it. <laughs> Dicks. Alright. So... Okay, I was thinking that'd be a teleporter pad, but no, that just opens up the rest of the map. Alright, cool. Well, let's go ahead and just reward ourselves. Because that is tense. Alright, so now we get the great unknown. And all we have is a pistol and our fists. I'm sure that's going to change at some point. And that's definitely a more heavenly section. Ah, see, it already changed. Told you. So I wonder if each, like, I don't know, this is all speculation. This is, this is a blind run. I've never seen this map before, so I uh, wonder if there's, like, multiple biomes. Although it kind of looks like there's just hell, hell, heaven. <laughs> so uh, I don't know. Let's go ahead and just follow this path here. So, I don't know, it's giving me, like, Minecraft nether vibes as I pass a fleshy little font over there. Um, can I get that? 
Uh, not yet, but probably later. I don't see a staircase leading up to it. And this is just a vast stretch of lava. It's so good. And I gotta say, the music, it's uh, pretty tense. I mean, it's just like this dark environmental track. Pretty good stuff. Pretty good stuff. Do I hear something? No. I didn't hear anything moving. I heard nothing. Alright, let's try that again. Because I think I can get to the armor. If I just do... <laughs> Maybe not that. Alright, there we go. Easy. <laughs> it only took like three tries. So, uh... Alright. Now we are over here. Kind of thinking of saving myself the walk. That sounds promising. Alright, what else do we have? We have a lot of bullets. We don't have a chain gun. At least not that I could see. Unless it's like up there or something. Either way, this seems to be an arena. Oh, there's... I'm smart. Oh. There's arch files. This thing's kind of nice about arch files. It's like, yeah, they have a low, low pain chance. But eventually you will be able to spew enough bullets in their general direction that they will have problems. I wonder if maybe I should just be uh, encouraging infighting between these fellas. Because you figure the arch file blasting those guys, it's going to do splash damage. Yeah, you know what? We got one. One distracted vial. Well, he wasn't distracted for very long, was he? Oop! That was close. Man, you know, you don't really appreciate how much uh, health arch files actually have until you have to kill them with a chain gun. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and just hit all the switches bring these guys, or actually bring us up to this level. Uh, you know, and give them a totally unimpeded view of us. Alright, I just need to get one side down, that's all. I'll just give me a few extra moments to breathe. Breathe in that lovely, fiery, and brimstony air. Alright, there we go. Okay, you guys good? Are you, nope, you're not, you're not calm. Alright, uh. So I can't quite, but can I get to those? Yeah, I can. Good. Good, good, good. So what we can do now is kind of move off to the side here. We don't have to worry about any crossfire from the other side. And just sort of slowly pick these guys off. Oh, the benefits of them having projectiles, and us not having projectiles. Alright, there we go. Yeah, we already took out 76 dudes. Only took 6 minutes. <laughs> Alright. Let's grab the uh, leftovers here, yep. Just enough there. And, um... There's a switch for us. One of these pleasant looking things. Oh my. That's a lot of... Oh, I don't know. There's one thing though. I've said this several times. At least the Lost Souls don't have a ridiculous amount of health in this. So you um, counter it by just putting in a ridiculous number of Lost Souls. I see. I don't like it. <laughs> Man, that hit scanner though, or the hit scanners I should say. That's a lot of chip damage. One might say that is a metric chip ton of... <laughs> alright, alright, that's, that's enough of that. It's too early for horrific puns. Too early on the map, at least. I'm sure things are going to change as we uh, as we move on, but yeah, 
in the meantime, there we are. All right, let's go ahead and just run through the pile of ammo. Does this hurt? No, it doesn't. Okay, so we can probably safely assume that blood is uh, safe in this one. It's not weird, tainted, demonic blood, I guess. And look at that, we're full on ammo again. Hallelujah. Now, were there any shells? Because I could have sworn I saw some, but... No, I guess not. Alright. I mean, that would make sense. This is a very uh, chain gun-centric fight. And now we're out of there. Jeez, this is just... Expansive. Yeah, there we go. Alright, let's... uh. Move on, shall we? Does this lead anywhere? Oh, there's zero secrets. Hmm. That's what I was thinking. Like, maybe there's a secret over here. No, there's there's probably not. At least nothing flagged. Jeez. Kinda doesn't man, just look at the how this looks on the auto map. That is oh. Does look like something straight out of your nightmares. But yeah. I'm kind of guessing that the lava is just a uh, a death pit for, I don't know, semi-obvious reasons. There's nothing else over here, well, aside from the ledge, which uh, definitely goes somewhere. Should probably take a look at that. Oh. So is there a way back up there after you jump down? Oh, hello. So there's no secrets, but there's, um, stuff like that, so, always good to check. Hmm. See, I would think that there would be some sort of way back up there. Of course, then again, maybe you just take the long way around on the little jumping, quote-unquote, puzzle. It's not really a puzzle, it's just, you know, there's jumping, that's all. Well, it's one way to find out if uh, you're completely trapped. Hmm. No, looks like there might be a way to climb back out. Maybe not. <laughs> Alright, well, let's just go ahead and do that. There might be a way, but this is faster. So I know there's that box of shells down there that I haven't that I haven't grabbed, but I kind of want to see what this is all about first. Save a little bit of time, you know. So soul sphere right there, and this just seems to kind of lead back to the uh, entrance, sort of what I was expect or what I was suspecting. Probably leads up to that soul sphere, yeah. Then you could... There's a sigil eye down there. Or evil eye. <laughs> kind of doing that thing that people do now. We just refer to those as uh, sigil eyes because, well, they were used in sigil. So that kind of leads me to believe that there might be a way of climbing the mountain again. It's going to be a little bit careful. Yeah, let's... uh. Drop a save here, and then just do a little bit of venturing down here. So I have a feeling that is kind of intended just to get your attention. I think I can just... Yeah, there we go. So around here, and up, and there you go. There's not a whole lot here, but, you know, box of shells, always useful. So now that I'm over here, I believe I will grab that other box. Jeez, this is... Oh, thanks, Elastic Collision. Yeah, I'm going to rewind after stuff like that, because this engine doesn't handle stuff like this very well. All right. Perfect. Flawless. Except for that flaw. But, you know, we don't... We don't count those things around here. It's too negative. Am I right? Yeah, of course. Oh, boy. I remember when I was younger, 
just the uh, number of times that I would die at the end of Tricks and Traps just because of the elastic collision, because you could very, very consistently get it to happen on those walls. <sighs> yeah. I'm not bitter. <laughs> Don't worry. So, yeah, I am kind of curious now. So if I just sort of go... All right, I'm just going to... I'm really kind of just exploring, just seeing what's possible here. I not really jump down at a particularly good spot. Let me try that again. About like right here, maybe. Ugh, damn it. It's not really enough room to get speed. Yeah, that was with an SR-50. There we go. Oh, that was incredibly awkward, and it led to nothing. So you pretty much have to make it there. And even then, no, that's too high to climb. Okay. So it kind of seems like maybe those reward paths are uh, just a one-time thing, possibly. Yeah, that, that would be my guess. Because I definitely can't go back in this way. Because, uh, yeah, that the whole ground rose up. Alright, well, let's go ahead and just move on, shall we? We can spend enough time just kind of figuring out the uh, landscape. Unless there's a way to climb up here, but no, that's kind of a sheer, fleshy drop-off. Or climb up? Climb up, yeah. Okay, there we are. And, uh... There is that over there. So how do I get there? Do I just keep going around? That might be it. It's a little bit uh, treacherous actually moving around in this map. Who, who would have thought? Um, you know, I gotta say, this might actually be one of those cases where I just end up actually raising my render resolution. Because normally I render at uh, 720 or at 720p. But, um, it might actually be a little bit too crunchy on this map. So, uh, I usually do that for, uh, I don't know, frame rate, because I use software rendering. I wonder if this is going to work. Because last time I tried changing to OpenGL, it really didn't play well with OBS, but we're going to try it. Hey, look at that. So we're going to crank this up. It's been a while since I've uh, used OpenGL. I think the last time I did it on a video... Oh, man. That actually looks weirdly smooth. Okay, anyway. <laughs> last time I did it on a video, I think, was um, that... Uh, oh, jeez. Antaresian Reliquary, map uh, 31. Because it had so many enemies on screen at once that I actually couldn't really maintain that good of a frame rate. <laughs> it was great. But... Yeah, this actually looks... <laughs> After, like, playing Doom at basically uh, half render scale for so long, this actually looks just almost uncannily smooth. Alright, so anyway. We've got, um... I think pretty much just this path. So we need all three skull keys, I think. I didn't really look too close. Yeah. Really kind of wondering about these other side paths. But I'm sure we'll get to them soon enough. Do, 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 do. Now, thankfully, this is one of those cases where the platforming, at least going up, is pretty straightforward. Oh, this area looks like a nice tall glass of water. Alright, now that we're over here. Oh no, we can't go backs. And, uh, alright, so we get the super shoddy here. And I heard nightmare demons, so, um, it kind of gives me a reasonable idea of what this is going to be like. Oh! Oh, okay. So they are definitely just here to get in your way. You know, I don't think I've ever done slaughter with a super shotgun before, so this is kind of an interesting new experience. I mean, aside from, like, I don't know go to it 
or something like that, but I don't know, at this point it's kind of hard to consider that slaughter. <laughs> Not necessarily because it, I mean, I guess it would be, would have been at the time, but I guess it's one of those like moving goalposts sort of things. Oh yes, please take those guys out with rockets. Saves me the trouble. Of course, then again, I guess I don't really have rockets right now, so, um... Oh, well, that was a fail. Alright, let's try hitting the next switch. Got that one. <laughs> My reality run of Eternity 2, map 36. <laughs> Yeah, except that'd be already be a fail because I took some damage. Oh, damn it all. Alright, so everyone's actually in fighting right now. Aside from those dudes in the middle, they're just kind of confused. Those guys are just, well, they're just jerks. I'm gonna just ignore the ones that are in fighting the Dominators. And then just occasionally, I guess, dive in and do one of those. Hoo-hoo! You know, standing still for a second does kind of get the Terminators to, uh... Oh shit, that might have been a mistake. Okay, that, that could have gone worse. <sighs> Alright, so thankfully those guys are infighting with the Revenants, kinda. So, that helps. The thing that I'm worried about most, actually, is the fact that I don't have any armor. So, uh, let's go ahead and get blocked by that guy. Alright, so we'll grab one of those. Grab one of these. Thank you for shopping at um, Ukira Mart. I actually don't know if it's Ukira or Ukira. I'm just going to go with my assumptions. And then, you know, it's that whole thing where it's better to ask for um, forgiveness than permission. <laughs> just pause the video and just go on Discord and be like, Hey, how do you pronounce your name? <laughs> so... Apologies if I'm if I've been saying it wrong this whole time. Shit, I really did not want to pick that up. Okay, there we go. I really hate those guys. All right. Yeah, I think what happened there is I got blocked by the Kako, who was like 20 meters in the air. Slight exaggeration. And, um, then I took, like, vertical splash damage from the Terminator. Alright, got him. So you know what my priority target is, right? <laughs> In case it's not obvious. You know, the whole thing where, like, a couple revenants is really not a threat. At all. There we go. Perfect. No, go away. Stop that. You're rude. I don't like you. Stomp it! Awesome. So how many of those... Okay, we got a few of those left. Alright, one down. They probably took quite a bit of damage at this point, so... Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and use... Das Chain Gun. Just thankfully, we ended up taking care of that other arena, so we have plenty of ammo for it. Alright. Great shooting, Spectre. Alright, so... <laughs> he killed himself! <laughs> oh, that was legendary. Good job, dude. Alright. Have I mentioned that those guys are not immune to splash damage? Because they're not. Alright, so he hit all the switches, which presumably means there's, a uh, Two health pots. Alright. It's going to be one of those, like, uh, oh, thank you. Is this going to be one of those, like, um, Ribbix type of things where you get these little health potions and it seems all, I don't know, mysterious and stuff, but turns out it actually just opens something up moving forward? Alright. Um, I mean, that might be. I'm just looking behind the crevices and stuff like that for uh, various supplies. Although I'm doing pretty well on ammo. This this map is... Wait, what was back? Nope, never mind. It's part of the texture. Yeah, this map is actually pretty generous when it comes to ammo. So, um... No real issues there. 
Probably also helps that... Yeah, what the heck is going on back there? Probably helps that I got them to do a lot of infighting. Are there switches up here that I didn't see? Possibly because of all the monster corpses. Okay, no. Did I miss the switch out here? We've got that one. We've got that one. We've got that one. That one. No, I didn't miss any. Hmm. No one is alive. Alright, so there's probably... I mean, it's obviously going to be something I missed, or perhaps something I wasn't looking at because it wasn't immediately obvious. Either one's either one's pretty likely. Yeah, that's the entrance there. The oh no, I can't retreat. <laughs> that section. Uh, I'm. It's got to be that little fleshy air or ooh, charming. There's also this mound of flesh over here. No, not there. Up here. Right there. Ah, okay. So, is that something we're going to have to look out for? I am not sure. All I know is that that did not trigger the, uh, whatchamafudgets. Are there others? Now I'm kind of wondering if I missed one of those in that other section. Right, what about up here? Can I spot one? It's kind of looking like that was the only one, actually. Hmm. Can't climb up there. Oh, okay, it did eventually lower this. Just didn't do it immediately. Alright, well. <laughs> serves me right for being impatient, I guess. Alright, what do we got up here? Aside from a whole bunch of health vials, which um, actually did add up to a pretty substantial value. Okay, so that's basically just leading the way out of here, I guess. Now, this is the tricky part. I need to find a safe way down. Where am I? Right there. Oh, it's so weird having it being a circle instead of an arrow. Alright, so it looks like right in front of me. We're going to do this just in case. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. First try. And I actually mean that for once. So, next step is to go up this way. Which looks like the return trip gets you a megasphere, which, uh, I don't know, I'm doing, I'm doing pretty okay right now. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of megaspheres just kind of scattered around here and supercharges and all that good stuff. So this doesn't exactly lead to where I was thinking it would, but that's okay. Let's go up here. And see what this is all about. Yeah, I gotta say, it is a lot easier to figure out what's going on in the distance with, uh, with the, like, full resolution. Alright, um... I hear a whole bunch of moaning, so, um, what's going to happen here, I wonder? And also, does each arena... No, stop that. It's rude. Don't do this. No, don't. Why'd you do that? You didn't have to do that, bud. The hell's your problem? All right, anyway. This looks like another, uh, semi-Rubixian trap. And, of course, the pain elemental just went away. All right, yeah, there we go. Just no, no, stay there. Stay. What? Step. Stay. Stay. Gotcha. Man, even with 50 health, these guys are uh, a little bit annoying. Hey, I got him. Nice. There's another one. Damn it! There we go. Anything in here? No. Distrust in the lack of secrets. Although it kind of seems like in this one there's uh, some secrets that are... That you can definitely argue are secrets. But, um... They're just not flagged as them. Alright, so we've got a fleshy barrier there. 
Uh, looks like probably the solution is just to drop down and uh, all that good stuff. So, let's do that. Hmm, deep blood. Schmexy. Alright, that lowered this. Okay, so there's our arch file cover here. So we can maybe start picking some of these guys off. Like the ones that are closest. See, easier said than done. And now do I have a... Yep, he is bleeding. That's good. Nope. Ah, oh, damn. Thought I'd have as much room over there as I did over here, but alas. Alright, what if I just do... There we go. I could use the boom extended HUD, but I really don't like it. <laughs> I want to kill at least one of these guys, just just to prove, prove myself and do a little bit of peen flexing. Alright, come on. Got him. All right, well, now I just have a bloodlust. They can only be quenched by the death of, I don't know, these guys. Kind of wishing I had a little bit more in terms of chain gun ammo, but you know what? He's literally right here. Just in case. All right. This next run should seal his fate. Told you. And you know what? There's the one over here, so... I'm sure these guys probably get crushed or uh, otherwise massacred. But, you know, sometimes you just have to take matters into your own hands just to make sure it gets done. Alright. Okay, there we go. Is there another imp? I thought I saw another imp down here, but apparently not. Hello. Come on. Get your ass down here. Immediately. Ugh. Gotcha. Little bastard. Man, I do love the uh, boom deep water effects. Okay, so that actually didn't really do too much for me. <laughs> oh well. Oh, is that a actual... Nope. Alright, so that's gotta be... Gotta be something. Oh, there's a switch. I'm smart. Stop that. Okay, that should lower... Yep, there we go. Awesome. We solved the puzzle. How puzzling. Hey! You know, it's a good thing that one fireball is uh, pretty relaxed overall. Got him. Nice little jump scare. Oh, balls. Alright, no, this is fine, actually. It's actually better that I ended up down here, I think. Wish I had a rocket launcher, though. That would make this uh, a little bit faster. I don't know if I would say easier, because, I mean, it is pretty much just uh, circling around the arena and occasionally smacking the fire button. Ugh. Yeah, it's nice when they group up, though. That, that just just makes things so much better. Can you imagine if I didn't kill the arch files? That's, of course, assuming that, you know, something I did before wouldn't have killed them. You know. Still kind of wondering about the, uh, the first section, though. Because it looked like they just kind of died. Like, they weren't actually getting... Like, they weren't getting crushed. But then again, that could just be an invisible crusher, I guess. Like, I'm just recalling that after all this time. You know, I'm starting to run out of ammo. Not comfy. Not comfy at all. So I need to be a little better with my shots, I think. Yeah, there we go. It's definitely spreading the damage out a little bit better. Of course, maybe that's one of those things where, uh, 
killing the Archviles ended up taking a little bit too much ammo. Ow. Yeah, it's been a little too long and too much time in one place there. Oop, that was a nice big chunky group. Do the does the word chunky really go together with skeletons, though? I don't know about that. So that's the thing, is if I can get their numbers down to the point where I could at least just start berserk punching them, that's all I really need. They should also all have quite a bit of damage on them at this point, so... There's also that. One shot. Tch. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Yeah, they only come down. It only comes down one at a time, anyway. So uh, I just take it a little bit easy. Take it easy. All right, perfect. So, oh, oh, I see. You know, maybe I should have just ran out here. Oh well, I'm sure we'll get more ammo later. Mm-hmm. I see you back there. Sneaky bastard. Well, there's the rocket launcher. I'm good at this game. Uh, oh, it didn't lower it enough. Another switch, I'm assuming. Yeah, probably another switch. All right. Well, another rocket launcher. Double up. Double the boom boom, double the fun. Oh, jeez. I was going to say double the fun, but then I saw those guys. Alright, we don't need those guys up. That hurt a lot. Yeah, I know. I really need it. Well, okay. The, the message changed. It's a little more encouraging in this one. Ooh, hey. Easy there, bud. Yeah, these guys are pure and utter evil. And unfortunately, I really don't have any close-range weapons now for some reason. Who would have thunk it? I wonder how many other people ended up doing exactly what I did there. I mean... It is a pretty cautious strategy overall to uh, try to take them out from a controlled section. Of course, high damage. Bastard. Alright. Are all the Manx dead? That's, I think, my main question right now. I know the Spectres need to go down, like, yesterday. Thankfully, they're somewhat visible here. Also, that's one of those things, too, where I never... I really... Because <laughs> I do run software. They don't really have good f uh, pixel fuzz scaling. So you can see how chunky it is. Like, it kind of resembles the old software renderer. Yeah, it's it's not very chunky in the uh, software renderer. Or the, the new software renderer. Is it really new, though? <laughs> it's, it's really not. Okay, well. Don't have shells. And you are just kind of hiding away in there. Got him. I also heard a specter die or something. Huh. They probably ended up hopping down there when I was uh, doing something else. It's not important. But uh, I think I grabbed all the rockets. Oh, it's you. Hey, <laughs> goodbye. All right, yep, that seems like uh, all the rockets have been acquired. Now... Do we have any health down here? Or for that matter, do we have any remaining enemies? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Guess the only way out is out. So it kind of looks like it's this little crack right here. Man, we're already 40 minutes into this. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Oh, this is the entrance. Shit. So, not there, obviously. I think there was another one over... 
Uh, wait a minute. It's another one of those egg things, isn't it? Maybe? Nope, there's only actually one little crack there. Oh. Piss. Wow, two stuns in a row <laughs> with rockets. That's, um, surprising. What if I just do that? Yay. I guess I could have climbed up that way. I guess I could, you know. I don't even know. All right, so can I get to that megasphere? No, that's from the other side. All right, well. The saves I'm throwing out are probably pretty redundant, but yeah, it's fine. So this led over there. Were there any other paths? I don't actually remember. Alright, so there was this here. Yep, this is new. No, it's not. Huh. Well, hey, look, ammo. And look, I can go back to this. Neat. I don't think there was any armor, though. But, uh, at least I have plenty of bullets on the ground. Uncollected bullets. So, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. I think uh, that's about it, though. 100... Oh, no. Nope, not quite. We're still collecting, ladies and gents. Slowly but surely. Yeah, those guys really didn't get that far. But there were a lot of them. 175. That's not a bad haul, all things considered. Right. So, we also had these shells down here that I didn't acquire. Oh, wait. No, I did acquire them, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Rewind back to here. Mostly because I want to see if there's anywhere I could jump to from here. It's kind of looking like a negative, though. And there's that area way over there. But I'm pretty sure that's for decoration. Alright, so. Oh, we do have a little... thing down there. I don't know if that actually symbolizes an area I can go to. Or an area that has something. Guess we'll find out now. I think it's about here. Uh. Nope, this is one of those uh, fiery paths. Jeez, this is just... I can't even imagine how long it took to make this map. <laughs> There's just so much, oh, well, <laughs> there's so much elastic collision, no, there's so much detail just packed into this, this is, I mean, this is actually unreal. Okay, and that makes that accessible. So something I did at some point, okay. You know, now I'm starting to wonder, maybe I should check for one of those little, like, egg sack things up here. I don't remember seeing any supremely fleshy bits, but I could be—I could just be missing it, or could have missed it. Yeah, because there's that area there which had the uh, supercharge and the armor. Then there's that really lovely switch that uh, totally doesn't creep me out. Um, and outside of that, yeah, I think that's it. And the entrance is just kind of right down there. Well, down a few levels. All right, yeah, so I think that's it for this section. I just happened to pick an early path that didn't have one of those, uh... Wait, did I see it? Okay, I'm seeing things. Okay. I just happened to pick an early path that didn't have one of those. All right, so let's go up this way now. Let's go up this way now. Oh, man. Almost, uh, almost did it again. But I didn't. Now, what do we have here? We've got two paths, one going up and one kind of staying at this level. So, um, let's do this one first. Okay, it is going up. And this actually goes back this way. Towards the... 
Eh, it doesn't quite connect to the Megasphere, but it does drop you off right here. I also noticed the other path I took. It gave me a weapon, but it didn't give me a key. Hmm. Interesting. Unless I missed it. But you know what? I can always go back. Maybe. Wait. Well, might as well check it. <laughs> Just in case. Ah, that was funny. Alright. Look, it's a big map, okay? Don't judge me. Uh, which, yeah, don't get me wrong. The rocket launcher was a very, very nice prize for this. Unless there was something maybe down there. Because I didn't really search this area super thoroughly. I just kind of punched that and then just walked away. Okay, yeah. So this is just... Uh, Alright. All good. So it turns out there's just multiple ways of getting up there. With that mountain path being, well... A little bit of a different one. Alright, so... Is there a way over there? Because that kind of seems like probably the next logical step. Maybe it's another one of those little... Yeah, right here. One of those little fleshy things and I just didn't see it. Alright. Balls. Alright, I hear a... Um, Astral Arachno, which is always my favorite. I saw a cyber demon. Yep. Oh no. Of course. Oh no's a cyber amont. Alright, can we get the Astral Mank? There we go. I guess let's just go up the stairs. Just go stand by the stairs so I can protect you. Holy crap! Wow. Um, this is, uh, I don't know. This is rough. Alright, so there's not a whole lot of enemies, but they're all in a very, very... Yep, blue skull. They're all in a very specific sort of area. Uh, there we go. Just kind of circle around until everything starts infighting. So that's the one nice thing about that. Is, uh... A lot of these enemies do have spray attacks. Right, let's just go ahead and save a little bit of ammo. You're, you're easy. Giggity. Ah, there we go. Super shotgun. Finally. It's like... Alright, so there's that guy up there. <sighs> well, I can't shoot, apparently. <laughs> not gonna waste too many rockets. I'm not actually sure if he's even accessible. Alright, well, same plan as before. I know if they use, like, the uh, golden shower attack, that's pretty much almost a... Well... If the timing's right... No, that's not it. No. No, wrong one. I couldn't tell who was actually attacking. Actually, the green one seems to be the most consistent for starting infighting. Okay, there we go. Shit. Got that now. For what it's worth. Ha! <laughs> Lovely. So, what's the approach here? Wow, that is the wrong attack, bud. <laughs> I mean, I guess I can shoot rockets at these guys, but... I can also collect shell. No, I can't. <laughs> just looking at that and yeah hmm 
ones. Purple ones... I think if our positioning were a bit better, I'd be able to do something about those ones, but... Ooh. Yeah, let's, um, collect some health, shall we? Alright, there we go. Stop that. Stop it. How are you shooting this much? What the fuck? He literally just... <sighs> freaking nightmare arachno. What the hell was that all about? It was like multiple unbroken shots, little bastard. Alright. They have a little bit more of a handle of what's going on at this point. So what I need to do is first go to the far area. And just punch the hell out of you. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> at least that was a 10. That's a, that's a rare mercy. Yeah, see, that's how long the burst should be. You literally chained like three bursts together. Oh, what a bastard. All right. Okay, and that door actually opens up. I got it. Let's go ahead and try to get something going. Great shot, dude. Nope, oh, saw one hit him. Bruh, what are you doing? There we go. That's a little better. Well, of course he would end up doing a pain state. <sighs> Little bastard. Okay. See, that's the thing. They need to hit the Cyber Demon with better attacks, because what they're doing now is lame. That's why I got confused. I don't like these guys. Alright. <laughs> yeah, that's a bit more like it. I saw, I saw the gold shower attack. Wait, what did... Oh. I can high it. I can low it. I could English. Alright, I think I need to raise it one more. One more step. And that'll pretty much bring him right into the... Almost bring him right into the line of fire. I mean, that one over there could still hit him. Okay, you know what? You're not even trying. Ugh. Can't believe I couldn't. Mm, yeah, he might be too high. Let's bring him all the way down. No, it doesn't. Okay, that's good. Ugh, you are a real pain in my ass, dude. Maybe I just need to go to the other section. I don't really want to... I don't. Well, I don't really have a whole lot of ammo to waste on him, so uh, that doesn't help. No, that's not really... If that guy does the green attack... There we go. Ow. It's really, really... Mm. Alright, let's uh, try to get that last guy to hit him. This is easier said than done. Really? Now you're not even trying, come on. Alright, so if I do this and... Alright, let's bring him down a little bit. Uh, he needs to take some damage from the Cybe. Come on. Whoa, easy there, bud.
Do the green shot. Not that effective. Can you can you maybe do more of the yellow? See, this feels like a collaborative effort. I'm kind of I'm kind of enjoying this, except for the fact that my teammate sucks. Are you shitting me? So unfortunately, <sighs> all right. Well, obviously that's not the answer. I mean, I guess I can make a grab for that Megasphere. I am going to go ahead and save here, though. It's been, uh... Nope. It's a little too far away. Gotcha. I mean, they can get shells on that platform, but... Is that sr 50 -able? It is not. Okay. It is not. Uh, well... Ugh. Seriously? Almost seems like you have to drop down into that section. All while dodging all of this mess. Yeah. Try doing that when there's a cyber demon shooting at you. Is there a way to crush him? Or otherwise explode him? Like that? No. That that opened up the blue door. Dude, every time I try to jump, he's already shooting. Alright. Just see if there's a... Uh... I'm gonna take another quick glance. There's also this section here. Does this have any... I'm trying to look, you asshole! Um, no, nah, it doesn't look like there's anything in there. But that is another... Okay, seriously... I can't even, like, look around for two seconds. It's terrible. You know, I wonder if that's... Seriously? How do you even do that from that angle? Is this one of those things that just crushes them if you raise it up too high? I guess we'll find out. No, it doesn't. Well, that's unfortunate. I gotta deal with that cyber demon. I can't really do much with him there, because, uh, yeah, for obvious reasons, because I literally can't line anything up, because he just starts shooting at me like there's no tomorrow. There's... Really? I mean, I think the idea is to use the astrals as a distraction. But that only helps when you know what you're doing. And I think we've already established that I have no idea what I'm doing. This isn't like... No. Nothing like that. Oh, right. <laughs> like, there's plasma! Nah, that's just what they drop. Oops. I mean, I, I can almost... I mean, that's definitely the goal right there. Can these... No, you can't have multiple things per switch type. Alright, well, everyone's dead. Except for him. Which upsets me. Alright, well, I'm gonna save. I think... Maybe if I do this and I actually have some speed. Yep, there it is. Okay. Real rockets have splash damage. That was an 80. Are you serious? It always, always. You take one hit. One hit. It's always a max damage roll. Alright, that one's down. Nope, nothing up there. A little odd, because I hit the switch that was the blue thing, and then the blue thing was all like, no. Um, right, so next stop is probably over there. So I need to raise this up probably one more. Two more. We're gonna do this, because... 
Uh, oops. I completely misaligned that. Yeah, what I... It's one of the reasons I feel pretty justified saving here, because uh, I would have literally had to go all around and do that puzzle again if I didn't do that. Yeah, it's one of those cases, like, you think a, a an 80 from a Revenant is bad? Wait a minute. Oh no, this is right. I guess the Cyber Demon took those guys out. Okay. Seriously. God, hitting switches in Doom is just impossible. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so this is all opened up. That's good. Now, uh, I need to find one of those little weird blobby things. Is there one accessible from over here? Uh, alright, that's the entrance. I recognize that pillar. Hmm. Well, at least this is all interconnected, I guess. Down this way? Probably? Oh, there's a switch. Hmm. Balls. <sighs> really? Oh, man. Uneven terrain. Doom guy's worst nightmare. Can you guys get down the stairs? Because that'd be actually pretty great for me. Okay. There we go. Oh, you guys probably can't go up the stairs either. Well, you guys are just useless. It's trying to punch the size of your face. Since you guys do seem to like punching things. But no. Alright, was there anything else down here? Doesn't seem like it. Nope. Alright. So, uh, back up this way. Yeah, that would be very nice for taking out a Cyber Amont. In a carful manner. Yep. Alright. Alright. So we're getting a new weapon soon. I like that. I like it. it... Alright. Well, we can't make it too easy, I guess. Oh. Yeah, I see. <laughs> I, I get it. <laughs> I've done this a few times. I understand. Okay. <laughs> and he explodes. Alright, well. You know what? I'm fine with that. Because fuck that guy. Alright. How many cyber demons were there? Did you see them teleporting in? Just one corpse after another. Uh, so there were probably four of them. That's that's good. Alright, well, we got through that at least. And now we're back out here. And we have a lot of cells. It's funny when you look at the kill count. I just have a feeling the last fight's just going to be just pure, unadulterated slaughter. Is there anything actually down here? I'm curious. It doesn't look like it. Hmm. Yeah, it's looking like just uh, dead trees. I, I can't imagine why they wouldn't be thriving in this type of climate, though. Just, I don't know. They don't have a strong enough will to live, I suppose. Alright, well, um, I'm just going to go ahead and reload. It's one of the reasons I like playing with saves, is it lets you kind of do a little bit more in in the way of exploration. So there's that. That leads up to a megasphere, which I totally need right now. Um, that goes back over to that side section. I still don't have a red skull key. Which, uh... Yeah, that fight, I think, that's where I got the super shoddy. 
It's just everything is so, so expansive. Yeah, good stuff. There's an evil eye down there, but it doesn't seem to have anything next to it, so, um... Probably not a universal indication that something is there. It's also a possibility that one of these little flesh paths might have yielded and... Like right here, and given us access to this, which I'm guessing is probably where we'll find the red key. Yeah, that seems like a pretty logical assumption. I sometimes have those once in a while. Oh no, I can't get out. I guess we're just gonna have to fight. <laughs> hmm. Really should have had breakfast before I started recording this. Oh well. <laughs> what you gonna do? It's too late now. Oh, I don't... Okay. I didn't think it was gonna be that easy. Well, um... Guess if you needed the rocket launcher before getting here, you're... You're set. Oh boy. Alright. Hey! <laughs> Man, Akira really loves his lost souls, doesn't he? <laughs> Look at this! Look at this! Now what's gonna happen when I run out of invulnerability? I think we all know what's gonna happen, so I should probably just kill these guys as quickly as possible. Am I even going to have enough invulnerability for all of this? Well, I think we know the answer to that question. To that silly, silly question. Alright, so what I can do... I do have enough room to move, at least. Oh. Oh. Okay, edges, got it. All right, there we are, and oh baby! So do these all have one revenant and one arch, or okay, they're just different. Got it. Yeah, let's just go out. Let's go outside. Hello, Vale Imps. Haven't seen you guys yet, which is kind of surprising. How did you survive that? What the hell? Was every single pellet, like, a minimum damage roll or something? Like, what the fuck? These guys don't have that much health. Alright, whatever. Use the plasma on them, because there's a lot of them. Alright, got it. Easy enough. It's another reason I use saves, because can you imagine an hour in and dying to something that stupid? Alright. Grab all the rockets ever. All the rockets ever made. Yeah, figured I'd wait to grab it for a few seconds. It's just save a little bit of time. This is so many lost souls. This is so many lost souls. There's gotta be some sort of like map or crime or something. I don't know. Also kind of reminds me of Micro Slaughter 31, which is, I don't know, <laughs> used in a very trolly way, obviously. Alright, go ahead and just soften them up a little more. Okay, we have a plenty of area on the outside of the room. We've got this. Oh. Oh, missed that switch. And by that, I mean I mashed the use key and it did nothing. So, uh, just doom things, I guess. Uh, God, that is annoying. Alright. Just gotta stay on the move, really. How many of these guys are there? Not that many, I guess. Kind of seems like they're, uh... Oh, no, there's a lot more behind me. That's for sure. Come on. Wow. This is probably not a good weapon to use against them, for being perfectly honest. 
All right, there we go. I gotta say, though, I think that's the only time the Veil Imps actually killed me, so, uh... GG. <laughs> of course, there was that one close call in, uh... Oh, which map was that? 24? Where I managed to just slip between an entire group of them somehow. <laughs> that was kind of funny. All right. So we got that. Now, uh... Oh, so there's multiple egress points. Is there a way back in here? Because I would like to finish everybody off. And I would also like those extra rockets. I'm guessing you just go in through the entrance, perhaps? Maybe just hit the switch again? Yeah. That would be a sir, yes sir. Really? Go fuck yourself. Okay. Yeah, let's uh, grab some health. <laughs> it's not much around here, but you know what? There's enough. A lack of armor, once again, that's the worst part. That is the killer. Because basically anything in there can one-shot me. Unless I manage to find two health kits, then the revenants will at least need to two-hit me. But, uh... Nope, not happening. Oh well. Only got, what, two sides left, and I could just stay up here? Oh no, I can't. Okay. Sneaky. Really? Yeah, just act like we're on Nightmare. No big deal. Yeah, the ceiling actually makes that, uh... Oh, you clever, clever shrew. Got him. Although I probably used more rockets killing them than I would have gained from this room. Maybe not. Maybe not. No, it's kind of... I kind of broke even. But you know what? I got the kills. That's that's the important part. I would probably use the super shoddy on the last guys, but uh, eh, I didn't. So, there we go. So this is the way... Well, one of the ways. That's the way I came from. This is not the way I came from. Are there any others? Kind of doubt it, but you never know. Nope. Okay. So let's go to the other path, I guess. At least I have an extra Megasphere that I can grab at some point. And there's a supercharge here. So that's kind of nifty. It's also that. Was that the opening? Yeah, that was the opening fight. Okay. God, it's been so long. <laughs> We're an hour and 13 minutes in. And that's the center area there, the little heavenly section. Oh, I just... Oh, that's... Yeah, I just noticed that. All right, so how did we do this? Uh, we, we went here. Obviously. And then we went over to this fight. Went to the complete opposite side. Ended up getting the super shotgun from here. Then we ended up over in this section. Which is where I got the... Rocket launcher. Then we ended up here. Which is where I got the plasma. So we have all the keys, so we could technically go over here. However, we have not gone here yet. So, we're going to do that first. And, alright, so... Do we, what do we want to... Want to place our bets? I'm kind of thinking that that would have given me an early plasma. That would be my guess. Oh, well. So just grabbing the keys actually opens the gate. Got it. Yeah, we got a mega sphere on the. W yeah, I'm just gonna grab that on the way out. Since I have the health, I'm sure there's probably gonna be armor over here, right? Right? Yeah, probably. So, so we climb around this way? Question mark. Upwards inflection. I'm Ron Burgundy. All right. 
Plasma. Plasma. Yay, I did it. Well, joke's on you, I already have the plasma. <laughs> really? Uh oh dear. What? I don't know about this. There's. This is making me very uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> the lack of armor makes me feel even less comfortable if we're being completely honest here so yeah maybe I should have grabbed that megasphere who knows I'm sure this is going to be possible no problem fuck you asshole alright <laughs> of all the things Stupid fucking Mancubus. Alright. Fall down. There we go. I dislike you immensely. Alright, we're <laughs> gonna do that again without the initial crush. How about that? Okay. <laughs> there we go. What the... What is this pattern? I think maybe the initial pattern's just a little bit jank just to get things going. Yeah, I'm actually more worried about the Manx because they can actually do a serious amount of damage to me. Let's just get one down on each side. And then... Oh, fuck you. Stop it. Love when they just instantly retaliate. Little bastards. Not so little bastards. Alright, one down. We have a Mega Sphere. It's fine. Oh. oh. Why? Okay. Don't you dare, sir. We're gonna try to keep them in the middle. They're running in. You fuckers. Fuck you! <laughs> Alright, anyway. Well, one of them went down, at least. Alright, what do we got out here? I gotta admit, I was not expecting there to be another uh, section after that. I don't know. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me thrice. What the hell's wrong with me? Alright. So, let's go ahead and get to the exit. Like, everything's fine. Everything is perfectly fine. Oh. What we got up here? Why? Well, at least we have this. This thing that he's not immune to, thankfully. <laughs> Alright. There we go. It's been splatted. Now, what is up there? Oh, it's just supposed to be symbolic. Okay. That makes sense. Not entirely sure what would have lowered there. Probably another um, megasphere or something. One of the ones we couldn't get to before. This guy. Are you. Are you. Really? <laughs> At least there's an easy way up this one. Anyway. Let's go ahead and go to the final section, which probably has all the remaining enemies. But I actually really like that way of uh, revealing power-ups and such. Just, I don't know. It's a really cool map. Just in general. A little brutal. Very, uh, like, the fights are very cleverly designed. Like, it, it's like... I need to stop saying like. <laughs> How can you tell? How are you able to tell I was a millennial? But anyway. Yeah, so the... F the fights generally don't have that many enemies in them. Like, I think most of the enemy count was probably from all those uh, zombie men. Is there anything up this side? I, I always have to check. You never know. But 
yeah, I mean, it's probably safe to say that half of them were just mostly trash enemies. But, like, with all the other fights, oh, it's just, uh... They use uh, small numbers very well. And I always appreciate that. So I always find it kind of interesting, because in, whenever you have, like, a slaughter compilation, you always get those maps that'll have, like... Oh, I don't know, 100 enemies, and they're always the hardest ones in the wad. and wow, that is, um... That's the thing? Okay, that's symbolic. Wow, this is beautiful. I'm sure it's about to get very bloody. So, uh... It's a pretty big arena, too. Now, this actually reminds me of something of one of the micro slaughter maps. Alright, so this is one of the side chambers. Let's get as much ammo as we can before we actually start this. Yeah, we'll go ahead and just... Maybe I shouldn't have grabbed all the ammo from one side. That might not have been the best idea. What's on the other section? I'll just have to remember if I need um, cells to go over here. Assuming they have cells over here. Okay, well, okay, they have small pickups, but they're here. Cool. Cool. So, do we hit both switches? Let me actually just explore this whole section. Because we still got... Oh. This charming little section here. Which... Yeah. I don't know if I can get back, so I'm just going to save and then... Does this hurt me? No. That's good. What in the world is that? Alright. I'm starting to think that, yeah, maybe I should go up here first. Uh, what about these two switches on either side? What do these do? Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, so these are actually bespoke arenas. Got it. So I wonder if, like, completing these arenas makes, like, the uh, actual hell section easier. So you're kind of, like, Cleansing the temple. Alright, got him. Kind of focus on the caco cloud. That way I can actually move. If I really need to. Ow. So we do have... Things. We have plenty of things. Purifying the temple. Just one rocket at a time. Right, there we go. So, let's go ahead and make this corner a little bit safe. There we go. We have a consistent place to run. Oh, great. Well, so much for that. Almost face rocket off of an imp. That's just embarrassing. Oh, that's a lot of imps. Holy shit. And the health is on the other side. Perfect. Nope, oh, got a little bit. Nope, shit. Yeah, that infinite height shit. I love it. It's the best feature of Doom, by far. Alright, so... Let's go ahead and wander over here. There we go. That wasn't too bad. So it's actually start... Whoa. Okay. Didn't realize that they slowly revealed themselves. Alright, there we go. So we've sanctified this part of it. Sure. <laughs> Alright. Let's deal with the cloud. That way we can move from one side to the next. When the imps spawn in, I think we... Well, I don't know. It depends on how our health is looking. We've got a bit more of a handle on this arena now, so it's not going to be as bad. Bro. Thank you. Uh, mm, mm -mm. Die. Want these motherfucking revenants out my motherfucking temple. 
Or I've had enough of these motherfucking revenants. Alright. Let's go ahead and kill these guys real quick. That way we won't have 80 damage missiles flying at, a, at our face. I think the imps are the final wave. I really need to rocket these guys. I don't want to use all my cells on freaking imps. Rockets are fine. Because it causes them to make that delightfully squishy sound every time you launch one. Okay, I got that guy. I was hoping you guys would line up, but... But no, of course you didn't. You're imps. You're little tricksters. Little bastards. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna clear out the imps and then hit the switches. You know what? We're gonna rush map one this shit. Alright, so let's go ahead and climb up the side here, because these guys are being a right pain in the ass. Die, please. Thank you. Okay, there we go. And up here... <laughs> Just completely slide off them. Uh, something something greased imps. Oh, there's someone up there that's still alive. Still in one piece, I see. There we go. Wasn't that fun. Alright, so let's... I hear more than one of them. Where are you? He's up here. Pretty sure. Wait, there you are. Nice try. So, got that taken care of. Let me just scour this area for rockets real fast, because I used a few of them. I know the next area has a lot of them, a lot of rockets, but, you know, why leave them behind, right? So the final area has a megasphere, so I don't really see a point in, um, might as well hit these while I'm at it. So I don't really see a point in saving them. Saving supercharges, rather. Because it's not like I'd be able to get out of the other arena and retrieve that one. So, uh, yeah. Alright, well I think we got everything we can get. Let's go over to the other side. Okay. <laughs> got confused for a second. Like, it's not letting me out! Alright, that's fine. So, go on a massive collectathon. Now, the last time it gave me this many rockets, it bombarded me with lost souls, so, uh... I'm scared. Not sure if collecting these ones in the bottom first are, is the best idea. Eh. Whatever. It'll be fine. Now, uh... These ones, and one of these. Here we go. We do have 100 armor, so we're going to go ahead and save the... Well, both of those. So is this going to do the same thing? No. Not quite. Alright. Nope! Alright, um... Let's go ahead and grab those things. We, You guys suck. Alright, so pain elementals need to die because they can very easily flood the arena with crap I can't get around. Because engine shenanigans. Although they seem to be pretty much contained into that little area by the astrals. So apparently the astrals don't like them either. And are just bullying them relentlessly. I saw those arch files up there too. I don't like these stairs either, because using rockets on stairs in the Doom engine is just asking for a face rocket. Because sometimes auto-aim just doesn't work. So, uh... Okay, I, I know. It's, it's code. It doesn't just randomly break. It's more that, uh... It's just so freaking picky. See, that's the thing. Like, I think... Oh, Auto-aim, like horizontal auto-aim auto would have been fine if it was at like, I don't know, a 5 degree angle and not a 35 degree angle or whatever it is. I don't think it's 35, but 
I can't exactly consult Casino's auto aim video right now, can I? Or Doom Wiki for that matter. Or the code. Just gotta make sure that they're not coming to my right. Okay. Bro, stop it. Alright, there we go. That wasn't too bad. It was a... Okay, this is not hurt floor. That's... That's good. That's cute. I think I'm actually going to use plasma on these guys, because... These are the only two? Yeah, I guess so. They're just in kind of a strategic location, and it felt like they were a bigger problem than they actually were. Alright, well, there we go. That wasn't too bad. I didn't die. Yay! <laughs> So, um, yeah, now I'm really kind of wondering what that does for me in the final arena. Oh, there it is. Well, we are, uh, we're good there. Oh, is there, oh. Hmm, stairs going up. So is that the exit, or... Or what? There's also stuff over here, so, um... I'm assuming we have a fight in the Great Hall as well. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, it's probably what's triggered at the top of the st Oh, that's a perforator. Okay. Things are starting to make sense now. So, I guess maybe we take care of this last wing and that's what unlocks the final fight so all these are required then so that's kind of what I'm what I'm seeing that's the vibe I'm getting oh, unfortunately my rocket supply is kind of shite but I think yeah maybe I just don't want to do that all right well you know you got to learn to fly before you can... I don't know where I'm going with that. Let's just move on, shall we? Let's go ahead and just unlock the cell pickup over here. Oh no. How much redonkulous stuff. At least these guys are ambush flagged. You really go all the way around? Seriously, stop it. You guys are being dicks. I don't like it. I deny you. I know there's more shells kind of around the arena. I think I was maybe meant to use this a little bit more. It's kind of scary because I can't really see the arch files, so I'm not 100% sure of where the zappy zaps are coming from. Holy crap. Dude, just die in two, please. Come on. I gotta waste my time, man. Balls. Of steel. So I'm hoping that the arch files are underneath a crusher. I'm hoping. Of course, the fact they're giving me a super char- or a mega, mega charge right there isn't particularly promising. Alright, there we go. Yeah, I just want to make sure the zap was over before I came over here. Yeah, I could use cells in these guys. No. There we go. Two more? One more. Must have. The one that was coming from that other side must have been the one that I woke up. Running, running, running. 
Yeah, there's only one switch. Right here. So, uh, let's see what this does. I don't like that. That's not a good start. Alright, we're gonna use, um, this. Like, a lot more in this section. Because there's a lot of pickups that I haven't used yet. I'm running out of shells. Well, there are some rockets over there, too. That's kind of nice. Also hearing more, uh, heck knights. Oh, noes. Oh, I shouldn't have grabbed that yet. I was doing pretty well on health. Oh, balls. Okay, well, that could have gone worse. <laughs> Wondering what, at what point should I be using the fist against these guys? This is the power of fist. It, no, go away. You guys suck. Get out of here. Needs more pinkies. Ranged attackers need not apply. There we go. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, see? Alright, so what actually... It's not that switch, is it? Oh, no. Okay. That was just meant to make you panic. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Fun times. Fun times. All right. Get down from there. Get... There you go. That's more like it. All right, well, we did it. Yay. <laughs> Actually, wasn't too bad. There's a lot of cover, so uh, you can't really complain. And now that area is... Uh, let's get those guys in fight. <laughs> Just seems like a good idea. There's a lot of them. And, I mean, they have, they have the health of a baron. Actually, can they in fight, or can they just hurt each other? Oh, they in fight. Yep, they definitely in fight. Although, weirdly... Oh, that's interesting. Their, um... Their Contra projectiles don't seem to do damage to each other. Only their rockets. Interesting. Alright, let's see. Who, who's... Who's the survivor gonna be? <laughs> Should I do it? You know, I'm going to rewind because I'm pretty sure I didn't save. <laughs> Can I get you to just... <laughs> I love it. Alright, anyway. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a whole lot of bullets. So hopefully I get more of, of them. You know, you're really enclosing me in this... Tiny little space. That's a lot of kills remaining. Let's see how this goes. Uh oh. That's that's probably not good. Holy shit, dude. Okay, that was epic. Oh jeez, oh man. What in the world? <laughs> um... Okay. That's perfectly normal. Holy crap, man. I don't even... I don't... I don't even know. I, I just don't. Okay, thankfully they don't have a raised state, so I don't have to worry about these guys dealing with them. Let's go ahead and grab one of those invis. Ah, there we go. Now I truly am a specter. 
Lamau. Ah, uh, yes. Keep raising these guys. Give me free ammo. I love it. Gotta say, this, uh... Oh, yep, there we go. I was gonna say, the perforator does not feel very powerful against those guys, but you know what? I think I just don't appreciate how many shots they normally take. Yeah, it, it does pretty good. It's pretty nice. What in the hell is happening? Oh my god, I'm so scared! <laughs> Everything is happening at once, and I don't... I just... I, I can't process it. <laughs> I love it. It's pretty great. Well, thanks for the free ammo. Yeah, let's, um... Oh, balls. How much damage does this thing do? Probably about a thousand per volley. Yep, there we go. Let's grab that to deal with the other spider mastermind. Uh, just, I don't want to waste shots on you guys. You, you guys just suck. All right. Um, there we are. Oh, that was just a waste. Yep, so this guy should be down in four. Unless that little bastard ends up taking the shot for him. Okay, um... I gotta say, that was a hell of a way to open a fight. <laughs> All right, well, now that we've absolutely ruined this place, uh, yeah, let's go. Let's, let's just leave. It's someone else's problem now. <laughs> wow, okay, this was, um, this was a map and a half, and it was basically everything I was hoping it would be. Especially that ending. What the hell, man? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen anything quite that excessive in Doom, and, um, I am absolutely glad I was just uh, I'm glad I was able to witness that because that was amazing all right well um wonder where I go back to the beginning perhaps where it all started wait maybe I don't know oh wait no no there's something okay the exit portal is actually in here glad I noticed that early or before making the journey across the map okay I was able to tell just from the line def colors so there we are there we have it map 36 kenosis Whew. yeah this is a big sprawling adventure like I love the fact that it felt like a legit adventure is it okay it's actually it was actually the cross. Okay, I get it now. It even had the uh, particle effects. That's probably why it confused me. Alright, it's fine. Let's just go ahead and do the jumps. And leave this place. Oh, man. Or maybe it's Kenosis. It might be Kenosis. But either way, one hell of a map. And uh, definitely one of the standouts. I think in terms of sheer gameplay I probably still prefer map 32 but man this one was an absolute spectacle so um very nice job Akira I can't even begin to imagine how long this one would have taken to make so um yeah kudos and like I said it was just very it was sprawling it felt like an adventure and uh that ending man I mean <laughs> it wasn't uh what I'd consider to be particularly difficult but at the same time it was just such a spectacle that I'm gonna remember that fight for a long time <laughs> you can uh, you can rest assured but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and leave you with that because it's uh, it's been a little while yeah only an hour and 44 on OBS yeah no big deal but um, thank you very much for watching everybody and I'll see you in the next one take it easy